Yo guys, I am back with another video, and this is some of the drivers. I'm not saying on how many because I'm going to go through a range of lists. A lot of them are going to be, yet again, equivalent to me. But let's actually start off not one that's equivalent to me because we just seen an idiot tried to power slide a McLaren Senna. The power slide gods, supposedly. Yeah, all quotation marks there. Um, these are kids that says, "Oh, I'm the king of drift." <laughs> then you've got us people who actually can drift. I'm retired from the drift scene, have been for a while now. Where I'm retired as actually being the drift god. So yeah, um, the only way that someone can physically call themselves that is beat me in a drift race, which I'd always keep the claim. Because I don't really have any, um, you know, I've got all my drift cars, but I'm getting ready to sell them all off. Like, you know, need to get rid of them. They're just... So what I just... Okay, let's just go back to what I was just saying. Um, so, for example, what I just done then, that's a power slide. Of course, that was uncontrollably because I'm in an 850 horsepower car. Like, they do that deliberately, and they say, Hey, I'm drifting. Every car guy can say, That's not drifting. That is just making an absolute idiot of yourself. Unless, if you're like me, you really can't, you know, control it. But, you can see there that some kids already tried drifting. And, and they're kind, and you can already see by the time marks that they've made a fool of themselves without even needing to be on camera. Like, I think these kids have just now left here. He was like, yeah, they've left. But um, there was a couple of kids here earlier that was like, trying to be like these power sliding type of gods. And they're more of um, buffoons on the road, pretty much, is what I call them. Idiots, jackasses. Yeah. I'm more of the ro full on role play, like 24 7 role play driver. Which pretty much try to keep the speed limit. I try, but at times I do fail a lot. Talking about those two probably idiots, they're on the highway right now. There is a couple of people going down, though. Like, you've got these kids physically actually looking like complete idiots sorry if my it is a bit boring i gotta admit nope oh. but more more or less you get these little kids like, we've got two there. It looks like they're getting ready to fucking street race. I got a minute. Down here, I do get a little bit fast because why not? It's the only place that I can do a semi top speed test on my car without. V12. 12 year old. That's what I call them. Every time I hear a engine swapped from V8 to V12, I instantly can tell it's someone that's got no brains. Sorry if you are those people who do like V12 swaps. Try not to criticize, but seriously, an American car that's a V8 or V10 start off with, why do you just turn around and decide to put a small lane in the exhaust pipe and put it as a V12. It makes no sense. I gotta admit, I'd done it in the past when I was, yeah, when I, I had car knowledge, but I thought of speed, speed, speed. The reason at the moment I'm not making any paint jobs, I can't. My um, my controller's fucked. Which that also puts me on to the next one. The guy that always blames everything on their controller, lose control. It's my controller. No, it's not. 
It's nowhere near your controller. Do you know what it is? I even admit it. I've got a lack of... I. It's called being an idiot behind the wheel. i got to admit. Yes, I am one of them. I have proudly come out and say, I am a fucking idiot at one of these. Why am I proud of saying that, you wonder? It's because I embrace being an idiot on the road. Yet, I do drive sensibly, but on the highways, hell, doing a top speed test until you hit a certain point on the road, Fuck yeah, that, that shit's fun, that, that's fucking fun. Like, there's no complaining on that, it's motherfucking fun. And yes, in case if you want to, I should have put a disclaimer earlier saying there is offensive language, there is no racism whatsoever in my videos, but if you hate swearing, why the fuck are you watching someone who is pretty much Australian in other words? Unless if you're talking about Modest Pelican. But yeah, um, another thing, if you are highly offended on the way that I'm saying about things, you know where that exit button is in this video. I suggest you click it. <laughs> so now let's get back into it. Um, another thing I do definitely um, suggest, or not really suggest, another type of car, well, another type of driver, the Maniac, which I'm doing a prime example of right now. These are the people that you just see blast down the fucking highways, usually in their over annoying sounding racing V12s. So I've got to say, mine, I'm not really being that idiot, but they lose control like what I just done. Of course, you, who does not lose control at like a fucking 300 k's an hour down the corner? But like, then you've got this kid that I'm going to be going up with. He thinks their Lamborghini is God. Your Lamborghini is not God, kid. Then their car just shoots off. Like, what the fuck? They see someone spawning them. Talking about it. Just talking about one of those freaking supercar kids. That thinks their car is it. So they slow down to try to race you. When you're clearly driving. Half the time when they do it, they completely fuck up. How to tell them that you're not racing. Lock up your fucking brakes. But then they're usually going to wait somewhere for you. Like, they're going to be like, Oh, this kid still wants to race. They call you a kid when majority of them... Sorry to say if you do own supercars. I admit it. I'm putting myself down here. I do own supercars myself. But the majority of the people that drive a supercar in this game is usually a fucking 12 year old that's done money glitches. My money sitting up there at 52 million is not money glitch. I actually sold off some pretty rare cars that I did get. I did get earlier on, so like, I bought them and all that. I, um, one of my friends did uh, pretty much give me what you call a money drop. Oh my god, talking about fucking Ferrari kid. I don't care about that kid's car. Then you get the people who are like me that, yet again, the I don't give a fuck what car you're driving. I'm the better driver then. I don't say that a lot, but ugh, when it comes to a lot of the people driving in this game, their driving ethic is worse than a Prius. Trying to go from 0 to 60 back to 0 again in a straight line. Like, 
They drive on the wrong side of the road. They like to throw cars out in front of you and most annoying. They just try to drift every tiny corner they see. Oh, normal corner. Just trying and drifting. No. Just no. What is the point of you having this like 1600 horsepower car? And all that you're going to use it for is to look like an absolute buffoon in crashing. More morons. Fucking drag racing on the highway. Why is everyone like doing this? One's a drift car and the other one is a crowd killer. Yes, I'm going by stereotype there, but one's a wannabe Ken Block kid. Like, they're obsessed with Ken Block, obviously. I don't have any of Ken Block's cars. Why? Not a big fan of his Mustangs. I call him a killed Mustang. Those 65 Mustangs are for cherishing, Ken Block. Not for destroying. And you, my friend, have killed him. I admit it, I'm completely destroying the sides of the road here by accident. Like, legit, if I got a party invite from him, I would just say, what the heck do you want? Like, it would be my clear response, what do you want? They're like, drag race, I'm like, shove your drag racing up your ass. Drag racing is not superior. Drag racing just proves you've got, uh, no talent. To drive a car, normal. Here's the thing. Driving a car normally does not require being an absolute cock to your car. Yes, I'm using references there, a lot of them, but like... Here are those kids, once again, drag racing. No, they're not. This kid's probably trying to come up to me in drag race. Going like, oh, another unsuspecting person to beat. The wannabe drag racing gods. You gotta hate them. Like, if you're one of them, sorry if I'm offending you, but, like, as I gotta said, these videos, if you don't like it, as I gotta say, there's other videos out there to watch. But if you don't like and how I'm fucking speaking, uh, you're not the, um, you know, you're not making the video. Clear to say you're just not making it, so. Yes, I am driving manual without clutch this time. My Xbox One controller does not have that button anymore. Oh, look. Driving normally. Wait for it. Wait for that Audi driver. Because I know I'm in a high-powered car. And I do like revving. No, instead they just got their bum buddy there with them. Exactly. Mercy Lagos and everything. What a surprise, they're driving on the wrong side of the road. I am as well, but I'm following them. Because I know how much of an absolute mockery they make of the car community. Like, the car culture in this game, it's supposed to be... I have an idea exactly what this game was supposed to be for, for, like, to have all these cars. Like, hell, I don't even have my foot completely down. Well, I do, and I've already caught up with them, with a bone stock standard car, may I say. That just proves on how terrible of drivers they are. Bone stock standard. Demon. These things, yeah, they're fast, but these things handle like a tank. They drive like a fucking tank. 
It's a challenger. And I still kept up. And this thing is a tank. On pretty much what you call steroids. Now this is turned from that to me ranting on about these 12 year olds. I do get sidetracked every... There we go. Spawn back. The I spawn back because I lose driver. And I want to throw a car out in front of everyone type of driver. Or, <clears throat> I've already discussed these kids, the 12 year old. But they think racing is life. This is life. That is life. That is life. And this is life. What the fuck is with these kids? Over glorified cars. Drag racing. That's all that they think about. They message me, it's like, you're drag racing or get lost. If they message me that, I'll be like, I'm actually laughing at them. So what's not to laugh about a kid thinking their supercar is God? Like, supercar is not God. Supercar is nowhere near God. Supercar does not equal God. Supercar equals money, yes, but God? Talking about a power slider. They don't even realize that my car is bone stock and yet they're in these customized things. Exactly, the kid that thinks you're drag racing. <laughs> what the fuck is that? They've just destroyed a Carrera GT. The wanker. That's what I just call him. I call him the fucking wanker. Yes. An Aussie. An Aussie thing to call someone, but highly effective. A wanker. There's nothing more to describe those kids than morons. That's all that you really can call them. Pretty much, yeah, I've ranted on for a good um, 17 minutes about on why these kids are hopeless. When there's another driver, which I can quickly just get into that car and show you that type of driver. Or I could just say, the 24-7 cop. They try to keep some sanity in, on the streets in Fozza, but... <coughs> Fuck. But, um, they can't. Why? Has anyone listened to a cop in Forza? No. Why? Because I think you're a raw... Are you 24-7 role-playing idiot? When really, you're not. You're just someone who wants to... I don't know, actually... Be a cop in real life. Like, a lot of these people that are like that just want to be a cop in real life. They're so desperately wanting to have that job. Me, myself... Mmm... I wouldn't want to have the job because um, yeah, like, it's just too risky, stuff like that. If they're using something not like that. Uh, where's my Crown VX for a second? They're usually floating around in a marked car like that. That's a ghost car, by the way, guys, in case if you're wondering what I mean by ghost car. I'll show you in the next video my cop cars if you want. Um, if you do want a uh, pre-built drift vehicle, uh, drift machine, let me know. I'll hook you up with one of them. Um, I will also get the paint. tune on that. A different kind of paint. And work something out for all these others. Because I need all these drift cars going. Like, I need them good. So if you guys want one, let me know. I'll pretty much just... I'll give it to you. I'll pretty much 
hand it to you at a giveaway price. Like, you know, I don't need them. Same with that. Um, the Nova, I might keep. Uh, the HSV, I'm keeping. And there are some cars I do want to get rid of. So if you're looking for um, non-highly glorified cars, i got to say. So I'm going to just... Yes, I am getting in a Lamborghini. But, you know. I don't think it still has its wing on it like how it does in the picture. I think I'll put this thing back stock standard because um, why not? Yes, I did. So that brings me on. Yeah, I'm driving a Lambo. But these things, they're supposed to sound like this. I actually wouldn't mind owning a Centenario. Actually, a pretty cool looking car. So, more subs and all that. Um, I can do more better content. Like, you know, like. Eventually be able to do live streams again, which I know you guys want live streams um, So don't forget if you want more live streams to come up in the near future um, Definitely hit the subscribe button. I'm on my way to a thousand subs trying to get there um, I may not do all these glitch videos and all that, but I do like tutorials like when I get a new controller I'd, I'd act, actually I can teach you um, on how to do 3D paints and Forza like it's simple well I can't full on teach you right now because I um, as I said I don't have um, a fully functioning controller for that but when I get a fully functioning controller um, leave it down in the comments section below if you want to get taught on how to do a 3D paint job in Forza like it's rather simple like Takes a little bit of time, depends on the colours you want, but eventually oh, where's one of my where's one of my finished products? Where where are they? Because I do want to do like that for this car and a couple of other cars on um, 3D. There's one of my 3D paints. Uh oh, fucking hell. Well there is a simplified there is a simple way on doing it, and then there's a complex way on how to do it. Um Okay, I did not do that paint tone, but I'm going to quickly show you what I mean by 3D paints um, do exist in Forza. Well, you guys should already know that. Um, so, what a three? Okay, this is a mat, but it's 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 somewhat 3D. Like it's a. Okay, I'm not driving that. That seems to sound terrible. I really need to fix that car up, guys. But, okay, 3D paint. There we go. There's one. And I know that is a 3D. If you want me to, I can teach you on how to do that. But as for decals, I don't know how to do that. So, this is pretty much a 3D paint tone ready. There is a fair few ways on how to make a 3D paint, but um, I'll put that in another video um, if you want me to. Just As I said, put it down in the comment section below what other Horizon 4 videos you want me to do, or if you want me to revisit Horizon 3, or try to remake this type of paint in Need for Speed Payback, which is actually going to be a bit more easier than um, Forza, because I, you know, I don't need the left and right bumpets. And my own, my left one's it doesn't exist. But um there we go, there's some drivers and